Hi guys, what's up? My name is Sarah and this is Planet Sarah. My last Legacies reaction is now my most viewed video, so thanks for that. Anyway, instead of rambling today, I'm gonna get straight into the video because I am so tired. We're reacting to Legacies Season 1, Episode 15. I have no idea what the episode is actually called. I haven't looked it up yet. I'll look it up later. But you can see the title of the video. It'll be in the title. I'm excited for Josie this episode because last episode we left off with her and Penelope semi breaking up if you get what i mean like they weren't together but they were like sometimes together you know what i mean now that penelope's gone josie has gone dark josie and we are here for it also her sisterly rivalry is building up so i'm excited for that just excited for hope in general because i love hope i'm not going to say anything about landon my dogs never shut up, do they? My dogs, oh my god, they're okay. They just want to go outside. That's why they're barking. And my sister's about to take them. There they go. They're going outside now. They get so excited, they squeal. <laughs> Alaric wrote down about the merge in his diary and Penelope told, told. Why did you have a voice break? <laughs> told. Penelope told Josie about the merge. So I'm pretty sure she must have read it gone through what her dad said about the merge and that's why she's turning into dark josie this episode also come and give hope a break her boyfriend just got like kidnapped <laughs> last episode he was dying then he comes back and she's like yes boyfriend and then they have an argument and he gets kidnapped he's so weird i'd like to know who he is though because the curly hair is kind of making me assume he's um his dad but he's also too young to be his dad i think kind of reminding me of um cole like he could definitely pass as one of the original vampires he looks like him you think a story's gonna change my mind? This one will. Because it's the story of your father. <gasps> dun dun dun! I'd like to know about his father too. Hi hi. Oh yeah, she wants to pet like her dad. We love an artiste. Hi Lizzie. Josie hasn't been sleeping in her bed. How sad. Where's she been sleeping? What's she doing? <gasps> That's so cool. First of all, they just put in a word and it comes out of all the books that have merge in it. That's cool. I want to be a witch now. I don't like him, he's annoying. Why does he turn evil every time he looks at Hope? What's he got against Hope? Hey Rick, sorry to take off like that, but I just need a little time. So I'm going camping for a while. Hopefully I can catch up. Camping? Do a summoning spell, or whatever it's called. One where they like put the blood on the map, you know? Or can they only do that of humans? I don't know. I've done all I can to help Raphael. Is she British? I'm getting very confused. Like, I'm British and don't understand. Hi, Lizzie. Was there a monster attack in here? Is he wrong? I got tired stats update. Josie didn't come back last night. I think she slept in Penelope's old room. Penelope's room? Not sleeping in the same bedroom means that twin forgiveness cuddle is off the table. Twin forgiveness cuddle. So these guys are friends now. Or is Lizzie working towards annoy Josie again? These two are so cute. Her hair. Why is her hair like that? It's kind of like Penelope's. Kind of dressed like her too. It says she's getting obsessed. <gasps> They've all been torn out. It's all your favorite things, which I'm sure somebody else had to tell you. Oh, <laughs> since. There is no monster more terrifying than dragons. So his dad's a dragon. <laughs> Why is so much blood? So they made a mud monster. Beautiful. How fun. His dad's a monster eater. Yo, I found out Jenny is 28. Like, there's no way she is 28. She looks so young. I'm just kind of nervous for um, Lizzie to read that now because she's going to find out and she's going to have to try and tell Josie. Wait, is that actually him? How this works, Hope, you have to listen. Listen to what? She arguing with herself then because if it's her own thoughts, just imagining him. So he has the DNA of like every monster in him. Imagine going from just being okay. She's literally dressed as Penelope right now. This isn't about needing space. This is about every waking moment of my life being suffocated by you. Oh. We should just have our own lives. We should have our own lives. Tell her. We should be our own people. But you can't be. You, that's the that's the part we. No, that's the thing. Lives. You can't be your own Best people. You're gonna merge. That's what the merge is, you know. Pretty yes, yeah, self-explanatory. Merge, coven, together. Years. You're the coven. You're the. A very gifted artist. Our? That's why they look alike. Yes. Hey, that picture's on their Instagram. I'm loving this hizzy moments, but oh, 
voice is stressful. Oh, who can play guitar? Completely irrelevant, but someone can play the guitar in that room, so. What? She can't control her brain chemistry. She can't choose to take her medication. She hasn't taken it since we saw her mom because she doesn't like the way that it makes her feel. She has medication? Josie knows everything about Lizzie and Lizzie knows nothing about Josie. Well, imagine throwing a teacher across the room. The whole school is messed up. I know exactly what it feels like to be an orphan, okay? I was saving you from- She's talking to herself, so she's thinking about her conscious thoughts, but like putting it in Landon's perspective, I guess. So even she is questioning why she cried in that dress. Why did I cry when she put on the dress? Um, okay, so that's his dad. He's melted on the floor. That's wild. Imagine like going from being an orphan, you're just a foster kid, and then you suddenly find out your brother slash best friend is a wolf, and you're some child of a mud monster, and is now a puddle on the floor. <gasps> Wait, no, the, no, stop it. They're attacking each other. Is it gonna cause the merge? <gasps> Holy moly guacamole. Freya just explained the merch. Josie's pretty much figured it out, and uh, Lizzie is spiraling. So either you do it or I will, but it's time to tell them the truth. Yes, tell them. But I'm scared. Don't tell them. No! <gasps> He's gonna tell them. There's something you both need to know. Wait, if you can summon him, can she summon people who have died? Every time I meet someone, this uh, voice in my head it tells me it's your fault. I shouldn't even technically exist. That I'm a cosmic mistake. I don't know. Hope so sad. I just wanted someone to think that I'm worth staying for. <gasps> Wait, that sounds really depressing. Like, so one of us is gonna have to kill the other one. I like absorb. When Gemini twins turn twenty-two, the merge will determine who will lead the coven. I don't want to cry. Why do I always cry? Riding your bikes for the first time. Learning to walk. I'm wearing makeup. No. This is gonna be what season two is gonna be about. It's gonna be about the merge. Don't kiss him. We can raise our father. Just weird. Like even for supernatural, that's weird. Why is she part of this? All hope does is protect people. She really is like Wonder Woman of the supernatural world. <gasps> Stakes. I'm like, what are they doing? What the hell? They're completely wouldn't you not? I hate the way they end these episodes. And this is the frustrating part about watching things in sort of live, you know what I mean? Like instead of watching like that like binging. Because when you binge you can just go, oh yeah, that was an annoying end, but like, I can watch the next episode now. So I'm pretty sure the next episode is the last one, like the finale, and these people have just invaded the school. I mean, we were in this together. We can be depressed together. That's that's our plan, okay? The whole Landon situation is very confusing to me. He's the child of a mud monster created by a vampire, a witch, and a werewolf to get rid of the other supernatural beings. So that's why they're the three main ones. But he's also not exactly a child. Like he's not the creation of the mum monster. Like he, this other go a guy, I forgot what his name is now, but the creepy guy with the same hair that I thought was his dad. He's a mud monster creation. But Landon is his, still his mum. Like he still has a human mother. But she'd been sent into Malivore, then sent back out, pregnant. What? If any of you understand the Landon thing, can you please tell me down below? Because I don't understand it at all. Lizzie and Josie, again, I cried. I, don't, I think I have a problem. I just cry at everything now. Like, I just, I could cry right now on the spot if I wanted to, honestly. Lizzie and Josie now know. Does that mean their friendship's gonna rise again? Are they gonna start talking or are they gonna get worse and compete for this spot? Because 
personally, I feel like now Lizzie's going to be like, okay, sis, I'm sorry. Let's just sort this out so we don't have to merge. But Josie's going to be stubborn about it now because she's still depressed about Penelope and she's going to avoid it. She literally threw her sister across the room. I don't know how they film them scenes because they look really fun. Landon. So she was talking to Landon and um, she sounded extremely depressed, like thinking that she doesn't belong, that she should just die. Like she literally thinks that she should die. She doesn't belong. Like that's so, that is, she's depressed. I d and now Josie's depressed, Lizzie's depressed, Landon's depressed. Who isn't depressed, you know? I'm depressed. Anyway, I would like to hear your opinions on the episode to see if you agree with me. Maybe if you don't agree with me, but like, don't be rude about it because I'm, I'm not here for that. If you'd like to talk about it, you can either comment down below because I love comments so much. Or you can DM me on Twitter, tweet me on Twitter at ShoniXMadnessa. Or you can go follow me on Instagram, comment on one of my posts, or DM me like some of you did yesterday at Madnessa X Shoney. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up and subscribe. If you're interested in any other shows, either tell me down below what one you want me to watch, or you can come back on April 9th for the bold type on a Wednesday. On a Thursday, Riverdale, Pretty Little Liars. Friday is Legacies, and Saturday I'll be doing Dynasty. My name is Sarah, and this has been Planet Sarah. <laughs>